Hey guys, so we're currently on our way to Disclosure Fest, also known as the Mass Meditation Initiative, and it's this really amazing festival. It's, what is it? What even is it? It's, it's not about anything. The thing with these spiritual festivals is that it's not specifically about anything. It's just a festival with love, vegan food, yoga, meditation, and uh, a good chance to connect with the universe. Yeah, and this one has a lot to do with the disclosing of information, like how to protect the environment, what you can do to take action steps on how to kind of like actually do your part in helping the world, with, hence why it's called Disclosure Fest. And there's also a mass meditation initiative, which is like an hour, maybe 40 minutes of meditation. Yeah, there's 45 minutes of meditation where uh, everyone at the festival is going to meditate, uh, I think tens of thousands of people, and they hold these events all around the world at the same exact time. So there's going to be like hundreds of thousands of people meditating at the same time around the world. And we were here yesterday and we volunteered and it was already like, I swear, one of the best days of my life. We met the most amazing people and had so much fun and we helped set up the festival. When it was over, I literally felt like that was the festival because it was so awesome. We were just mind blown that the festival is actually tomorrow and we had that much of an amazing time. So I'm just super stoked to go right now. We're walking in right now. Last night after we were volunteering, uh, we were just walking around LA and this guy literally ran up to us and he said, oh, are you guys wearing psychedelic stuff? And, I was, and we were like, yeah. And then he started talking about how he's bent over 300 Grateful Dead shows. And then we were talking for like 30 minutes, an hour, just some random interesting guy. And it turned out he was like spiritual in a really interesting way. and. Uh, he was going through a lot of shit in his life, and it was so meant to be that he ran into us because we told him to come here. So I'm really hoping to see him today. So this is our um, Nescafe protein smoothie. It is um, vegan, completely natural, 13 grams of protein made with almond milk. We have banana and mocha. Uh, I'll try ban mocha. Okay. Banana. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. I can give you one of each if you want. I love mocha. Okay. I, I love Thank mocha. you so much. This is perfect. I accidentally left my microphone at home. So I hope the audio is gonna be okay. So sorry if it's not too great. Look at this place though. Want to oh. tell me what the World Tree a Peace Tribe is? World Peace Tribe, well, um, kind of speaks for itself, but it, it's a combination of the indigenous teachings and wisdom and also the wildlife on the planet with sustainable practices that embody collaboration and flow state so, mm. and genuine human connection. So it's basically allowing people to reconnect to themselves and others in that place of just always giving your best, giving and receiving in harmony and doing the same with nature and indigenous cultures and we have a peace center in Nicaragua where we make all these um, peace sticks paint them with symbols of peace from around the world of all the kids there and um, we work with other tribes in Colombia and Peru and we're gonna go to Africa this summer with the Maasai tribe and so <laughs> it's, it's fun and, and this is a uh, look at this guy nice buddy yeah. that's awesome Wow, that's really good actually. Yeah. <laughs> I'm impressed. And what's your name? Jake. 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 Yeah, I think Thank I've you seen for you doing before. that, man. That's awesome. Yeah, brother. What um, are you posting this on? This YouTube channel. Yeah. Just um, spreading this kind of shit. So now we're gonna look in each other's eyes and we take three breaths. That is amazing. Where do you get the inspiration for this stuff, man? Dude, lots of different things. Psychedelics, fucking going to festivals and seeing all the love and art that is in the air. It's you feel it. And you 
feel the energy and you feel something connecting to you that makes you want to take it to the next level basically and yeah. expand your consciousness when you feel the energy things. I bet this stuff just the, seeps out of you exactly huh? you feel the energy you kind of get into like this trance almost like you're tripping but you're painting a and, flow state or, exactly a flow state yeah whether you're whether you're in the flow painting or if you're doing fire spinning flow or if you're whatever your calling is yeah it kinda gets you in the groove to to want to go further and to want to make make the best of what you can be and to take it to the next level and to, to just make it make it super badass like hell yeah yeah what's the instagram instagram is cole hazard so it's underscore cole underscore hazard underscore but Throw right here just type in uh, cole hazard and you'll be able to see it Western psychiatric medicine, yeah. it just covers up your problems. Oh, no, dude, you know, Xanax but and all these things that they use to, to treat anxiety. Yeah, it covers and it up. It, all it does is numb you, dude. It numbs you, it but does, it doesn't deal with the problem. Look, that's you know why. I mean? That's what's amazing about now psychedelics being legalized because it gets to the bottom of the problem and solves it. No, that's the whole thing. You know? Psychedelics show you what it is yeah. that you need to work on, but what it is that you need to work on. Yeah. Oh yeah. Good for Chris. So I'm gonna help volunteer and uh, just sage people, but I don't really know how to do it, so she's showing me. Christina, what brings you out here? Hmm, what does bring me out here? Positive people. What else? Amazing vegan food. Crystals and sound baths to soothe my soul. Tell me something you think that's profound about this event. Profound. Yeah. There is so much strong energy here, that's yeah. for sure. And the synchronicities that happen all around and the love, love vibration is everywhere and you just feel accepted no matter what you do, no matter what you say, you're accepted here and that's special and you can't find that shit anywhere. Oh yeah. Do you think uh, these kinds of events play a big role in society right now? Yeah, absolutely. Do you think it's spreading? Yeah, fast. Yeah. It's spreading fast. Yep. And you could find it in, in different, I feel like they're vortexes. Sometimes. Pockets of it. Yeah, there's yeah. pockets of, of the same types of vibes. Absolutely. But it's everyone's different knowledge. Like, that's what's special about it, is everyone's bringing something different to the table. Yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, that strap is. Nice. Oh, God. That's four sticks. Yeah. Oh, nice. Getting that flow state. Nice. There's no way you can get the flow state for the that Yeah. Well, I don't know about that. <laughs> There's literally four of them strapped together. Oh, there. what? <laughs> wait, why? Just because we're Just it's easy we're to the carry. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, wait, let me see this. Oh, yeah, this four, 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 three practice staff oh, and yeah, yeah, yeah. together. Does that help you get better three times as fast? <laughs> four times. Oh, four yeah. Four yeah. Oh, that was really tiring.
Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. I originally went to Disclosure Fest with really strong intentions to make a solid vlog, but the plans fell through a little bit, mainly because I left my microphone at home and I knew the audio wouldn't be too good, so that discouraged me to whip out the camera as much as I would have liked to originally. Also, I just got so lost in the sauce at this event that I didn't record that much, but I thought I'd still string together some footage. Uh, just for anyone that wants to see what Disclosure Fest is all about. And I know that uh, broadcasting this event and the amazing people that were there is bound to spread some love and positivity around. So uh, once again, I hope you enjoyed. See you guys next time. See you soon. Peace.